Souls RNG has a ton of cool auras such as Archangel, Bloodlust, Abyssal Hunter, Sovereign, and many, many more. But none of these auras are over 1 in 1 billion rarity. Well, if you saw my video last week, I talked about how Red Full Moon might become the first 1 in 1 billion rarity aura. But what if I told you that for the last month, a total of 100 aura creators have been working super hard to complete the very first 1 in 10 billion rarity aura on Roblox Souls RNG? That's right, you heard me correctly. A 10 billion rarity aura. Well, that's exactly what we're going to be checking out today. But before we get to that, first check out how many of my subscribers have cooked with the Batches subscriber alert. Also, I'm doing even more giveaways once we hit 400,000 subscribers. So make sure to subscribe if you're not already. All right, now let's get into the video and go check out this absolutely massive aura. And we're in. Today, I have one of the most epic things to show you guys absolutely ever. So you know how I've covered many auras in the past? Of course, I've shown like whitelisted auras and future auras coming to Souls RNG. Well, today, I am not kidding you guys. I have the most epic one yet. And I know I've said this many times in the past, but I promise you this is the most insane one you will ever see. The aura I'm about to show you is not a 1 in 1 million rarity. It's not even a 1 in 1 billion rarity. It's an absolute unit and a 1 in 10 billion rarity on Roblox Souls RNG. Now, I've known about the creation of this aura for like a month already, but I've not been allowed to leak it. But since the other day, it's actually been posted in the Souls RNG Discord server. So I can finally show it to you guys. And honestly, I've been so excited to show you this. Now, the aura I'm talking about is called the Ryan, and I'm not going to waste your time any longer. Let me just go ahead and show you the aura itself. Okay, so this is what the aura looks like. And as you can see, it is absolutely massive. Now, before I play this video, which is three minutes long, we're first going to to go over how this aura was created. And by the way, quickly, if you're wondering where the character is, like where's the guy that's controlling the aura, if we zoom in down here, you can see he's actually all the way down there, which is absolutely insane. But yeah, before I show you the video of that, because it will blow your mind, let's quickly go ahead and take a look at the progress of this aura and why it's been worked on for one whole month now. Honestly, this has been an absolute insane project, so let's go take a deep dive into it. So as you can see here on the 25th of July, I was messaged by one of the aura creators and they said hi again, a little spoiler from a big event aura creation happening. And then they did say, and don't say nothing about that for someone YouTuber. So I think what I got from this was basically please don't leak this on YouTube. And if we take a look at the photo here, you can see one in one billion and the aura is called the Orion. So this is the first leak that I got of it basically a month ago now. So then I said, ooh, okay, so maybe a one in one billion aura is coming. I won't say anything looking forward to seeing it. And if you guys saw my video last week, I did actually cover an aura which could be coming to Roblox Souls RNG that is going to be a 1 in 1 billion rarity. So Orion was bumped up to an amazing 1 in 10 billion rarity. And you're going to get to find out why later. So then here, the aura creator did say it's really big and they sent me this picture here. Let's go take a look at it. So as you can see in the picture, the character was meant to be stood on the right like this and the aura, yeah, it just looks like an absolutely massive space station. And they even said here a ship will orbit Orion. So there's little ships that fly around this insanely massive aura already. So then I go on to say, yeah, that's massive. And then they said, well, let me get the aura and size of Gargantua just to compare. This size, and yeah, I forgot to say, it's 100 people going to make it, apparently. So apparently 100 people worked on this. I'm not sure if this is true as of today, but I think those were the initial plans that just a bunch of aura creators were going to work on this together. So of course I said, wow, okay, I really can't Cannot wait to see this. And if we take a look at the first draft of Orion, here's Gargantua, which is already a massive aura in Souls RNG. And here's the Orion aura. Like, dude, it's what, like three, four times the size of Gargantua? Like, that's absolutely insane. And then I also got sent this picture. So look at this. It said Orion size. And as you can see at the bottom right, that is a little character down there, okay? That is a little avatar. And if we scale back out, look at the size of the Orion aura. That's like 50 little characters stacked on top of one another just to reach the size of the Orion aura. Honestly, I can't even believe this is real. So, of course, I then reply saying that's insanely big. Surely they won't add this in, right? So then again, two days later, I got another ping. Hi, this time I need to ping, but it's important. Don't leak and don't show for someone. Okay, so I wasn't meant to show it to anyone and honestly, I kept up my promise. I didn't show this to anyone for one whole month. If we take a look at this picture, now you can see it slowly coming together. So there's different levels being built up. I think these are meant to be the ships on the side. There's like some sort of ball on the left. And as you can see at the very top, there is a giant sun at the top as well. I said, dude, 
dude, that looks amazing. Do you think it would even get added into the game? As you can see, I was pretty skeptical that this was even going to be a real aura just because of the size of it. Like, I genuinely cannot believe how big this aura is. And as you're about to see, I did get told as well that it's supposed to be the size of that mountain up there. Picture an aura that's literally the size of that mountain back there. Like, look how tidy I am stood here. I got told that curators and more people are making it, so obviously it's backed by a lot of people. And I did get leaked that there is apparently credits that come in with this aura as well. And once again, I got told that don't leak the aura, of course. So apparently it's supposed to be like a Star Wars style credit, as we're going to see later. And this aura creator did also say we want to add an ability as well. I once again reply, I won't leak, don't worry. That's incredible. Really excited to see more of it. And then this is the second time that I get to see the aura. So as you can see it now, okay, it's really coming together here. It looks a lot brighter. All of the pieces are kind of fitting together better now. And it's just starting to actually get built up into what the aura is supposed to be. Of course, I say, ha ha ha, that looks so crazy because obviously it does. Then I tried to get some data on when this could be released into the game, but unfortunately I got nothing back and they weren't sure of when it could come out to Souls RNG. Then I got told, fun fact, the core of the aura, it's meant to be kind of like realistic. It's like a sun from a Google image. So this is from Google, the sun right here. And then this is from the core of Orion. So they've done an amazing job. Like, how is this even made in VFX? I have no clue. For me, this looks like it could be the real sun down here. I just comparing the two images, that's actually insane. Then I also got leaked the music of the aura, but I'm not going to show you this yet as I will be able to show you that with the aura itself in a minute. Then take a look at this, guys. This is the Orion aura compared to some of the already existing auras in Roblox Souls RNG. So as you can see down there in the middle, that's meant to be an Abyssal Hunter. To the left of the Abyssal Hunter is Sovereign. But if we zoom back all the way over here, look at the size of Orion. How is this real? It's like five Sovereigns stacked on top of each other. No wonder this has become a 1 in 10 billion rarity, not a 1 in 1 billion. And the very last sneak peek that I got of it was basically this. So this is almost complete, I believe, at this point. I think it needs a few more retouches, but that's basically the aura now come together. Okay, so now that we've been through the history of Orion and how long it's taken to make, we can finally go ahead and take a look at the aura fully complete and why it's gone from a 1 billion rarity to an absolutely insane 1 in 10 billion rarity. Okay, so now I'm on the official Souls RNG Discord server, and as you can see on the left, I've gone to Aura Forums, and I've gone to Orion Submitted. So this was posted in by the Aura Curator Krillix, and it was posted in a couple of days ago now. So as you can see, it is still a 1 in 1 billion rarity during nighttime, but it's gone to a crazy 1 in 10 billion rarity during daytime. So the lead credits of this aura go to Place, Salmon, Super, Krillix, Kiera, Genesis, Skib, Orb, and Veil. I'm sorry if I mispronounced anyone's name there, but I'm pretty sure that a lot more aura creators did work on this as well. So honestly, shout out to all of you guys as well. Sorry if your name isn't mentioned here. Now let's finally go ahead and take a look at the video that you've all been waiting for. All right, and here it is. This is Orion. Now, as you can see at the top, it does say one in 10 billion. Oh wait, it's gone away. Okay. So here at the bottom is where the character is meant to stand. And we're going around the back now. You can see it's just this massive techie space station that's spinning around. Around it, there are three spaceships flying around. At the top, you can see the core, which is the sun. Look at this thing. It looks incredible. One in 10 billion. The Souls RNG aura. I didn't even read that in time. Okay, Orion, one in 10 billion. Lead creators. Here is everyone that made it. Non VFX contributions. Main VFX contributions. Okay, shout out to all of these guys. Other contributors. Dude, look how many people worked on this aura. This is absolutely insane. I didn't realize it was that many people. Okay, but let me go back to the aura itself because I don't think it gets shown again. Okay, let's go back to the aura. So here it is. Look at this thing. There are so many things going on. It looks amazing. I love the way that the character stands as well at the bottom. This looks absolutely incredible. Oh, and the music is this for as well. I'm going to stop talking for a second. So even the music is epic. It sounds very spacey. 
honestly, to me, I absolutely love this aura. Even the writing and everything just looks so spacey. And as you can see, it is a 1 in 10 billion rarity. And there it is. That is pretty much everything to catch you up on regarding the Orion 1 in 10 billion rarity aura. If you liked all of the sneak peeks that I'm bringing to you guys, make sure you do subscribe because honestly, I have plenty more news to talk about regarding Souls RNG. And of course, I will be covering even more future auras in one of the future videos coming very soon. So like I said, make sure you guys do subscribe to keep up with all of that. And I hope you enjoyed today's video. Honestly, I am so excited for this aura to come out. I really hope it comes out in the era nine update. But we'll just have to wait and see. I'll catch you guys in the next video.